Hello everybody, welcome to the Nintendo Switch presentation, th live reaction and commentary. I have a special guest with me here today. I help Loxton, you introduce help yourself. Loxton? Uh, I have a Loxton here. <laughs> I have him tied up. I'm not tied up, Looking at nor the am I have gun to we're, face. We're sitting here in his gar dark garage filled with weird things. An old TV show memorabilia. <laughs> Have the uh, stream hooked up to multiple cables to get it to plug into this TV from the 80s? Yeah. <laughs> no, no we're, in, we're in his office. We're here together doing this. We thought it'd be a little fun to both give our, I don't know, our thing, our, our, re thoughts. Reaction, our thoughts. That's a and good word. I'm so nervous right now. <laughs> All of Nintendo hangs in the balance. I've been checking Twitter and everything. So many people <clears throat> that even have in the past not really been interested in Nintendo since the Wii are watching right now, yeah. including Smash Mouth, of all people, I just found out. <laughs> Smash Mouth? They just tweeted about this. <laughs> when Smash Mouth is watching your thing, you know you got something. No, I've got a lot of friends who just, like, they ignored the Wii U entirely. And a lot of the Wii, in fact. And Most just, of the Wii. Yeah. Like, it was a cool gimmick the first year, and then motion controls died. Yeah, they just didn't care anymore. And yeah, they're pumped. Like, not only are they pumped enough to be interested in the system, they're watching this. That says something. They've never watched a thing, not even E3. They just, you know, they get the news as it comes, but they're that pumped. This is how important this is. This is how Nintendo survives the next generation. They are, all eyes are on them right now. Everyone's, they have us. They just have to deliver. And that's what's so terrifying. I have to go nervously vomit. Can you, hold on, no. Okay, no, I think I'm okay. Hold it in. Oh. <sighs> Just lay on the floor. I'm just gonna lay down here on the floor for a little bit. <laughs> Let me know if you need me to get a bucket. Ice, ice pack. No, I, I don't know. I think I'll be okay. It's just so. It's uh, they've made so many mistakes, and uh, on a personal level, they have made a lot of design game design decisions that do not fit my personal taste. I will speak only for myself. I agree with you most of the time. In, in addition to a lot of decisions I will say are objectively bad. <laughs> but, uh, so that's why, like, this, there's always the future. There's always more. There's uh, Things could always change, but right now it's kind of like this exact thing is where we find out if they learned. Mm -hmm. if, they, if they started to listen, or if they have shifted directions. Like, all, a lot of signs are pointing to yes. Just the design of the Switch itself that we know of so far... A lot of it points to, yeah, this is different. But uh, we won't know for sure until a few minutes from now. Uh, and then we have to sit and watch for the whole hour. And they're going to save the best thing for last, so the whole time we're watching it, we're going to be panicking. Yeah. Saying, oh, this stuff is good, but it's not amazing. And yeah. then, then they'll get the big epic reveal at the end, and it will be something other <laughs> than a uh, new Mario. Yeah. And I, I, uh, if, if it's okay with you, Loxton, I probably will talk... I imagine that you've all seen all of this already. Don't let this be your first exposure. I mean, you can if you want, but I mean, I don't know. I'd, I'd like yeah. to commentate. Yeah, I'm probably going to be commentating over the whole thing. Yeah, that's good. That's that's what I wanted. That's my goal, at least. Unless something is just so awe-inspiringly amazing, yeah. you just have to sit and bask in it. Yeah. Two minutes. Two minutes. That's why they're showing the audience now. Metroid Prime 4! Mm. Also, I believe this is going to be subbed, and then it's, they're releasing the dub later. Yeah, that's what it sounded like. <clears throat> I can have a live translator. <laughs> or watch, it's, it's not going to be dubbed at all. Or yeah, it's, it's just all in Japanese. You just have to understand it. I don't know how to watch gameplay footage in Japanese. Your eyes just see a blur. <laughs> they have different... One different minute? Under <sighs> okay, a everybody. minute, actually. In a minute, every well, you know, throughout the period of time that takes place after a minute. Oh, it's oh, counting down. <clears throat> Everything might change. I'm, or it might stay the same. That's yeah. the problem. It's not necessarily that everything changes. Basically, in 47 seconds, the Wii U officially dies. Yeah. <laughs> They're pulling the cord. No more marketing. I can't handle this. I don't even believe... Uh... I'm, I'm hoping they go from 20 to 1. <laughs> I wonder if I can fit in a quick vomit. And I'll save it till after. <laughs> I don't have any buckets in here. And this is the one room in the house that has carpet. Please uh, do not vomit here. <laughs> no promises. 
Twitter's going mad. Oh, you're gonna be you're gonna be one of those guys. Yeah. On your Tweety phone. That countdown. I don't have a. Oh, I forgot to get my laptop in case pre-orders go up. You can watch for me. I'll just okay. get out of my, <laughs> get out of the back. Do you have, are you on Amazon? Do you have a? I will open it right now. Okay. Do you have an email notification for Amazon? I have an email notification <clears throat> for Best Buy and GameStop. Okay. Oh. Oh, it's loud. You got. That is a little loud. <laughs> there we go. <sighs> Yeah. I can't take it anymore! <laughs> Get to it Too already! Too much! Look away! <laughs> Could have a seizure. Huh? Lag spike. Don't lag. Don't you do it. Oh, I think that was pausing the music that time. Yeah. <laughs> Here we go. Kimishima's first appearance. Hello, everyone. Oh, oh yeah. Right. It is dubbed. I am recording, just making sure. Everyone viewing the presentation live online. Many people around the world watched the Nintendo Switch video we released in October of last year. And More than you know. Yeah. <laughs> he knows what a YouTube is. This video introduced the Nintendo Switch console. Nintendo Switch Dock, Joy-Con Grip, and two Joy-Con Controls, as well as the Pro Controller. You get so many of those. Nintendo Switch is a console that can be played while connected to your television, but it is also a system you can bring with you to share the fun wherever you go. Nintendo Whatever, Switch just a tablet. Is a brand new kind of home <laughs> Skyrim isn't confirmed technically. Bethesda's still denying it. Are they still? Yeah. In today's presentation, we intend to provide a detailed introduction to the Nintendo Switch hardware and software. Thank goodness. <laughs> oh boy. Super Mario Run HD. <laughs> I'd like to begin by introducing the Nintendo Switch launch date, suggested retail price, March, and online services. <clears throat> I can't remember what my prediction was. Nintendo Please be March. Switch will release simultaneously on March 3rd, yes. 2017. March 3rd? And the U.S., Canada. Whoa! Major European countries. That is 20 days earlier than my prediction. That is way <laughs> earlier than I thought. <laughs> I was thinking end of March. That's crazy. Because end of March is when I heard the Breath of the Wild is rumored to come out. This suggested retail price for Nintendo Switch. In Japan, it will be 29900 That's about 250 I thought that's a little higher. That's like that's like three hundred. Oh, it's like three hundred. That's three hundred. Yen's going all over the place right now. Cool. <clears throat> Definitely was hoping for a two fifty bundle or skew. If okay. it is as strong as the rumors are, I, I'm willing to pay that though. <clears throat> oh, I am for sure. I just thought you know for the just the. I just, I just mean like even if I wasn't like super pumped for it, I'd still pay that. Yeah. If it is as strong as the rumors are saying. Oh. Better than it has been at, at least, please. You will of course be able to enjoy online multiplayer games. Pay for it. And when you use the smart device application that will connect to Nintendo Switch, you will be able to invite friends to play online, set play appointments, and chat with friends while enjoying online matches and compatible games. It already all sounds a better. Smart device. But you have to do it on your device, you can't do it on your Switch. Try out Nintendo Switch online services for free during a trial period. Oh. A paid service yep. Beginning in the mm. fall of it better be good then. Yeah, better. They better have a lot of games for it. Hey, that's one prediction for me. And I have an additional piece to this mix. With our past systems, <gasps> Nintendo 3DS and Wii U. Oh, oh my gosh. Region locking, which limited play to software sold in the same region that the hardware was purchased. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's this way now, too. Wow! Nice. I would have bet money against that. <laughs> I would have literally bet money. Here, I would like to switch over to the man responsible for all software development for Nintendo Switch and mobile applications, Mr. Shinya. That's exciting. Shinya, who's it? I don't know this guy. I'm so surprised. 
Yeah, definitely. Nintendo's never done that. No. Good afternoon, everyone. I am Shinya Takahashi, and I lead all Nintendo software development. Then why don't I know you? Nintendo Switch <laughs> has inherited DNA from each of the many hardware systems Nintendo has released to date. That's Bill Trennan. The Nintendo Entertainment System included two controllers in the base system. Game Boy made it possible to bring video games out of the home. Super NES added the X and Y buttons and the L and R Going buttons. Going through the whole history. Yeah. The Always got to do that. Nintendo 64 offered the world's first analog control stick. They're always innovating. <coughs> it introduced a rumbling controller with the development of the rumble pack. Mind blowing, by the way. <laughs> we put a handle on Nintendo GameCube so it could be carried around. <laughs> I mean, I guess the Switch kind of has that because you can yeah. portable his eyes it. He even sees that he thinks it's funny too. Yeah. added a touch screen. With the Wii remote, motion control became possible. The Switch can make pizzas. And now, Nintendo Switch has inherited all of Nintendo's entertainment. Touch screen. And we have packed each and every one of the into the system. But there's no handle. Nintendo is constantly pursuing new forms of entertainment to bring more fun and more smiles to the world. And the new entertainment we will present in 2017 is Nintendo Switch. People are already joking all over Twitter about the GameCube handle the joke. <laughs> <clears throat> it's so thin for a console. I know, right? It's going to need so much air yeah. to not overheat. Nintendo Switch is a video game system for the home. I knew it'd have motion control. At least gyro. Yeah. You want to play away from the TV? You just remove Nintendo Switch from the dock. Those bezels. When you attach the left and right Joy-Con controllers, you can continue anywhere. Nintendo Switch has been designed to be a home console gaming system. That's how good the reveal trailer was. Is It said all of this yeah. without words and in two minutes. <laughs> like, this is all old news. Next, allow me to introduce the play styles Nintendo Switch will offer. TV mode. Play games on the TV in typical video games. Also, there's Mario Kart. So, yeah. You know, you're, they're porting Mario Kart 8. Tabletop mode. Scan the Nintendo Switch <coughs> with its fixed stand. I have that on my phone. Whoa. Yeah. He does. He's not lying. I'm never going to do that. No. <laughs> no I'm not, I can't play on those little things. My hands are too big. Yeah. The left and right joy to the system. You can take it with you and play it indoors, outdoors, or anywhere you like. Or in the middle of doors. Whoa. What do you think of handing a joy to a friend or family member and sharing the joy right then and there? Nice. Also, every time you want to press the B button and go right. Ugh. That's what I figured. Oh, it's yeah. six and a half, though. So. Okay, on the higher end. Yeah, so like two and a half with Zelda, six and a half for simpler games. Yeah. USB C. Yes! Whoa! The future! Yay! That makes a humongous difference. Whoa. Nice! That's smartphones. Wow, capacitive. I think that's smartphones. Yeah, resistive is the crummy one. Yeah, that's Wii U. it. I'm surprised. Honestly, I'm surprised it has touch. Yeah. Totally. Yes! That many... So, Splatoon, for real. It's kind of... Turf Wars. What do you think? With its three play styles, Nintendo Switch... Okay, so far. <laughs> other than the price, but that kind of reflects the other things. Yeah. Of, you know. It would be 250 if it didn't have touch. Right. To tell you more about the new 
prototypes of play the Joy-Con will enable and to tell you about Nintendo Switch software, I'd like to switch things over to general development producer Yoshiaki Koizumi. How many times is that going to happen? Hello, everyone. I am Nintendo Switch general development producer Yoshiaki Koizumi. So they have, like, all these different new guys doing this. It's yeah. kind of amazing. Very important when it comes they, like, reworked their whole right? staff. That's great. That's what they've needed. Yeah. Not really. I have a pretty good idea. These are the Joy Cons set in the Joy Con grip. This is the basic style when playing on the TV. It looks a little on the small side for me. Yeah, it is very small. I guess this is why I'll probably just get a bunch of the Pro controllers. Yeah, I, I've never was interested in that before, but I might be now. We uh, we understand. Are you gonna do a magic trick? <laughs> it's gonna get it. Where's the handkerchief? Each Joy-Con has an analog stick, and each stick can also be <clears throat> like a button. So like every other console yeah. since the PS One. This Joy-Con has the familiar A, B, X, Y buttons, and beneath them is the home button. Did I ever tell you how I had an idea, like, just like this, when I was thinking about the Switch, like, before we knew anything about it, how I imagined they could, like, how they could continue the Wii U. It could be, like, a tablet thing where you take off the controllers and put them into, like, a neutral one. Like, hmm. it was pretty much this exact thing. I mean, not the exact thing, but So it has those. Amiibo ability built in. As a what? Amiibo sensing. Oh, and there. Oh, okay. In the future, it will be able to capture video as well. Whoa. That's nice. You will be able to share the screens you capture with friends over social media. <laughs> I don't know why that was funny. I don't think anyone does that on PlayStation. Does it have IR? Independent left and right motion control. Holy cow! Possible. Oh my gosh! They really, they did everything we thought they would. SL and SR? I can remember that. Each Joy-Con can be used as a fully functioning individual controller. You can hand a Joy-Con to the person next to you. For games where you don't need two sticks. <laughs> we call this sharing the joy. Ha! Huh. Nice. So, Nintendo Switch comes with two controllers right from the start. Looking forward to Samba de Amigo. Yeah. You with me? Totally. <laughs> Now let me just switch some of this joy over. No, I'm really surprised about the motion controls thing. So that means we... He didn't say IR sensor, though. So does that mean not necessarily Wii games? This is amazing. <laughs> they put a couch just for him to sit on right there. For four seconds. He's doing it. Oh my oh, gosh, he's just... actually doing it. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> or, it's, or it's just very predictable. <laughs> it's just... To be the buzzkill. Well, it's funny because he was what he was wearing before made me think of it, but not this. <laughs> wow. Guess which one I want. Mm, the blue one. With wrist strap. So yeah, they're showing off the Wii remote function now. Yeah. Oh, a little now extra. Now it's safe. A little extra hand thing. That's actually nice. Oh, it, may, it makes it curved too. Yeah. So the buttons are actually buttons. I like that a lot, actually. I'll still take the strap off, though. <laughs> Watch all the games are all just going to be like Wii Sports motion control gimmick like. again. <laughs> I cannot believe that happened. The right Joy-Con also has a motion IR camera that can sense the shape, motion, and distance of objects in front of it right here. Nice. I'm, I'm starting to think that with all these features, the power is not going to be there. And it can tell how 
Like, how can you include all this technology and still have power? They might be doing the, uh, I think it was the GameCube method, where, like, they actually sold everyone at a loss. Hmm. I think it's a good idea. Yeah, because the idea is you make the money back in games. Yeah, and they usually don't like that. They usually like to make money on the system, but hopefully they just are changing their mind. Mm Mm-hmm. Is this just rumble? It must just be like a detailed rumble. This new sense of realism is produced by the precision of the new HD rumble. <laughs> HD rumble, wow. 4K or go home. Might be like eight or so little rumble packs all throughout it. Wow. It's cool, but the more little things like this they announce, the less excited I am because I'm feeling like it's going to be it's The Legend be- of Zelda rumble in your hand. Yeah. <laughs> Super Mario Ice and Glass. <laughs> like I didn't Mario want Kart, to... Mario Kart Rumble. Yeah. It's just constantly shaking because of the engine. <laughs> I didn't exactly want them to have too many of these little things because it just distracts, ever, distracts them and adds more money. Mm-hmm. I don't know. We'll see though. Oh. Here's the thing. This is the thing. What's it going to be a thing? Multiplayer. It's a game everyone can play together. With cowboys. <laughs> Not what I expected. Did you know, fun fact, Western is the w- least selling genre of any genre of movie? Wow. Hopefully this doesn't prove true for games on <laughs> the on game systems. <laughs> maybe this is just, maybe this isn't even the game. It's just like the, the funny teaser introducing it. I'm just going to pull out, like, neon pink silicons yeah. <laughs> and shoot each other. Western-themed launch game. I called it. Just kidding. <laughs> I'm, like, going and, like, changing my prediction on my blog post. We all know the punchline. Just get to it. <laughs> we know what's coming. Pulls out a cup with ice in it. <laughs> <laughs> like, What? Yep, this is. They had to have something. I thought it was just going to be a thing that played games, but it's there's the the, the little thing. <laughs> I, I can't off the top of my head think of a lot of cool ideas, but I'm sure they have a bunch. <laughs> okay, this was not a real game reveal. <laughs> this was like a. Oh, okay. If there's like a whole bunch of different stuff. Yeah, this is probably like this is all from one game, probably. So like, the, like the new Nintendo Land or whatever. Yeah, yeah. This is a feature that I don't think anyone saw coming for them to just totally get behind and have it be the thing. Wow. I mean, this is really a thing. And then the super pessimistic side is like, okay, well, we'll all play this, and then the feature will go unused forever. Yeah. That's what happened with the N- Nintendo Land and Wii Sports. You play it for a month, and then the yeah. gimmick's done. What is one two switch? I am also the general hardware director for Nintendo Switch itself. Mm. That's the game. Oh, right, right. Let's enjoy the expressiveness of the Joy-Con HD Rumble that was just introduced. But at the same time, it's a brand new kind of game. One that mixes up new kinds of play that haven't been seen before. Your if you don't count what we've done before. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Switch can be played without looking at any screen. So then, where exactly do you look? It's like a spin the oh. bottle of Bumpy's party. Okay. What? That's actually, if it works as well as the commercial made it out to be, that's actually pretty cool. Which which aspect? The not using the TV. It's all on the controller. Right, right. Are they just faking? Did you ever play Bumpy's party? Mm-hmm. The party game on the Wii U? Uh-uh. A lot of the games are like that, where you just use the Wii remotes huh. and like the sound effects coming out of it. In other words, one switch isn't a 
a game you play facing a screen. It is a game that is primarily played through face-to-face -face interaction. Again, though, that's a, a one-trick pony. Yeah, like, this, you'll bring the steel party, and they'll and then you'll have fun. Cool. You might bring it to a second party, and then a few of the guys that were at the other party will go, hey, you brought that again. Yeah, I've Can we do something else? <laughs> It's pretty cool. I don't want to be. I don't want to knock on it too hard. It really is just like, will you do more with it? Like any Nintendo thing. Like, okay, that's cool. Yeah. How much will you do with it? Because in the past, you keep just not doing anything with it. They can have a bunch of sections in any game where like you don't like the screen goes black and you have to like. You fall into a cave and you have to like feel around or something. <laughs> it's a little bit. It's like imagination virtual reality. <laughs> it's sort of like you feel around. The game everyone can play together. Next, let's look at a game with depth, challenge, and replayability that uses the joy con A new gameplay experience is born. Let's switch to it. Uh, puns. He said depth. <clears throat> I don't know if we'll find out if he knows what that means. Sexy businessman. <laughs> and uh, oh, is that him or is that a different person? <laughs> I was like, is he wearing a kilt? Okay, no. <laughs> this is uh, extremely similar to the other one. Bum bum bum. Goofy boxing. Oh boy, everyone's favorite. Is this still one two switch or are they showing off something else? I thought he said a different game, but it's like the yeah, same this, thing. Yeah, this should be part of that. <laughs> he just said, now I'm gonna show you a game with depth and challenge and replayability. And this just looks like it should be another mini game on it. Yeah. Maybe it's like a third party. Ver well, maybe this is another thing of like, oh, this is using the idea, but a different company is doing it or mm -hmm. something. <clears throat> or like, it might actually be deeper because it's like actually a game. Yeah, it's actually a game. You're using just, the screen here. Not actually. just a party game. All right, well, I'm still not exactly interested in it. Yeah. I'm. If it's cheap, then I'd get it. Yeah, I mean, I'm still trying. I mean, I'm still staying positive here. I know there's more of the show to go, but so far, like the little, the little concept party games is not ever going to be something I'm like super stoked on. Yeah, like they'll, they're fun. For a good chunk of time. Yeah. You know, that's, if, that's you, not if you're spending I'm... if you're spending ten dollars on an uh, hour yeah. worth game, I mean that's fun as long as it's a fun game. I'm just that's not like a game game yeah. to me. I want long-term stuff. I'm wondering how this plays out. Like, are you, are you looking at the screen? Are you boxing at your Switch against another person boxing at their, theirs? Oh, I hadn't even thought of that. Like, I, I don't exactly each, each know. Each person using their own Switch? Yeah. Hello, everyone. I'm Sosuke Yabuki. I'm the producer of the Nintendo Switch game, Arm. <laughs> That's a funny name. Today, I'd like to introduce you all You think the boxes are going to be sideways again? Like they were all the way through the 64? I don't know. That's what they keep showing. Huh, maybe. That'd be weird, actually. Yeah, I don't think I'd like it. It's more advanced punch out. Yeah. Boxing was always really cool on the Wii, and it was always just like, <laughs> yep. you just wish it could get deeper because yep. of the better. Punch out on the Wii was actually pretty good. I heard it was. So, yeah, it's just deeper punch out with a gimmick. You move your character by tilting the Joy Con. Putting so much emphasis on the individual. Mo I like. 
I didn't actually think they would include the motion controls. I thought that would just be another thing to raise the price and be a thing. Mm -hmm. And if they did, I thought it would just be to port Wii games. <laughs> like, no, that yeah. would just be the only reason. His hair looks like toothpaste. It does. <laughs> It does require two switches. That's what it sounds like. That's, so any of these multiplayer... Well, okay, well, the other one, two switch is like looks like one switch. Yeah. But this one, like... I don't know, because if it's split screen like this... I mean, I imagine you could connect more Joy-Cons to one system. That's true, but you, that still means knowing another person with a switch. I guess true. that would... One well, copy of the game is really the most important thing. Yeah. I mean... This already looks somewhat better than Punch Out, minus like the character design and stuff. Yeah, it could be pretty intense. <clears throat> I'll review it if I know someone else is going to have it, <laughs> because <laughs> otherwise there's no point. And maybe it'll launch it at a cheaper price. Yeah, I really hope. I am afraid they're going to charge full price for it. I hope they don't though. I'll be surprised if they don't announce. Uh, uh, 350 with pack in games or something. Yeah. You can battle alone against the computer. And you can play split screen against the I mean, you gotta have two SKUs. Yeah, there you go. Two player split screen, one Switch. Oh, okay. Awesome. And of course, we're preparing online battles as well. Of course. <laughs> what do you mean, of course? You haven't done that in the past. <laughs> <clears throat> it's not even a launch game? Thank you very much. It's a little surprising. Hmm. Yeah, that seems like it should be one. It was it was pretty okay. I just, you know. Is that a new first party <laughs> IP? <laughs> Can, are those guys going to be in the next Smash? That's what I was just thinking. <laughs> Arms guys? Stop. <laughs> Here we go. Splatoon port, Splatoon 2. I don't, I don't think it's going to be a straight sequel. I think it's going to be like an enhanced port. I've always thought that. But we'll find out. You've got to have it at launch. you got to. If it is a port, it has to be a launch. Yeah. Full sequel, I don't expect this soon at all. That's like one year. <clears throat> Unless it's maybe like the first one, but extra levels and stuff. Yeah, I mean, I, I... If the controls were better. Like, that was my only problem with Splatoon, was I didn't like the controls that much. Hmm. Like, you have to use motion, but the motion on the gamepad isn't quite good enough. Right? Yeah. Like, but, like, oh, did you see that? Dual wielding. Dual wielding. Nice. Each Joy-Con. Yeah. yeah, these are new weapons. I think it's just going to be new weapons, new levels, but, like, largely the same game. Oh, look at that. It is possible to use the screen and not yeah, use the touch screen. I wonder with the dual ones if you could point in different directions. I kind of doubt it, but maybe. Although, did we see two reticles earlier? Might have. That'd be OP. Unless they, like, shot not fast. <clears throat> Jetpack! So, they're, if it is enhanced, they're adding a ton. Yeah. Which makes me think this is a sequel. But, you know, like, nothing crazy new. Yep. Oh, my gosh! I am... I mean, graphically, it looks about the same. Yeah, so. just... Two. So, they got, so they, they got all the design done. Yeah. I would have... That was another one I would have bet money against. <laughs> it's just so early for a two. Why didn't they call it Splatoon? With a W in there. Because everybody already thought they would. <laughs> With a W. Yeah, Tune. Splatoon. Splatoon. <laughs> I'm so surprised. Yeah. And actually looking at the screenshots, it does look a little better. Like there's more stuff in the background, mainly. They just don't do sequels that fast. Yeah, Nintendo's never done a back-to-back -back sequel like that. But I mean, like, if the COD team can do that ten years in a row. Oh, yeah, sure. I mean, it's possible. <laughs> I just didn't think they would. Here's the 
this. The special weapon, which can be activated after springing enough time to think, are all brand new. Thanks, I'd rather just hold the controller. The introduction of new weapons, all new special weapons, and new battle stages to see the emergence of new battle strategies. Is there a new single player? Check our research tape and see if it's bigger. I want that. I want a bigger one. Allow me to report briefly on controls. Of course, you can use the Joy-Con Fantastic. Controls, but you can also <coughs> play using the Pro Controller. You can play on a TV screen, and you can also play in handheld mode. They're going to cover that with every game, aren't they? Mode, you can use <laughs> yeah. Controls to aim your aim. You press the X button to view the map. And to do a super jump, you press the button assigned to a teammate that instantly jumps there. Of course, you can battle against friends and people you don't know over the internet. Oh boy. And you can also <gasps> bring your Network play. Hopefully it's the cheapest one of the three. What is it, what? Like, compared to PlayStation Network and Xbox Live. Oh, yeah. I mean, they're not they don't, have... they don't they don't offer as much, unless they include, you know, big Call of Duty Battlefield-type games. Yeah, I They don't include it. as much. So, like, it should be cheaper. Planned for launch this summer. <laughs> it's planned for launch in the summer. There will be stage and weapon updates after launch. Oh. So it's not even releasing finished. Yeah, just like the last one. Yeah. Well, hey, summer's not bad until they delay it. Yeah. <laughs> Which is what they usually do is launch window games. They don't stay in the launch window. <laughs> no, I'm being positive. It'll come in summer. Yeah. But, like, if they couldn't release it three months earlier, <laughs> they wouldn't, like, yeah. You know. Or maybe even, like, del delay the Switch. Yeah. Because it needs a strong launch thing. I guess they want the year to be good and not have a big, you know, nothing. But it's like, okay, we need launch <laughs> games then. It took me like three <laughs> seconds to get that. What squid do you think? Splatoon 3! New Dunk City? <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Is it... No, this is this is a more Americanized city. Yeah, the last one was to Tokyo. More normal. Hey, that's messed up. <laughs> Samus comes out. <laughs> oh my God! Oh, they're finally bringing him back to Brooklyn. <laughs> After like thirty years, he's back in his home city. Are we getting a real? What the heck is this? Mario. Okay, what? I expected this. <laughs> I so expected this. What on earth is this? This is our new Mario? I'm still really surprised they showed it. I didn't think they would. Okay, so he went somewhere goofy. He's not just in, in, in a city. That's good. Dude, this looks open. Yeah. I mean, I can't completely be sure. I never will until I get complete confirmation. Oh my gosh, I think it might be. Yeah, that's, that's pretty open. Oh my gosh. Like, it might be more of an in-between. Yeah. This looks weird. Does it look weird to you? It looks... He looks like he controls smooth. weird. Yeah, it's... I don't... Something is just different about it that I can't quite place. Oh, wow. I don't even know what to think about this. I think it looks amazing. I, I and think I, it does. Sugar Skull immediately sold... <laughs> Buying this game oh my on gosh. release. That's the same voice clip from the last one. Yeah. <laughs> he can throw his hat he now. He can throw his hat. I'm just, I don't know. It's sometimes <clears throat> something, whoa! Sometimes something is so different that I just can't, my brain can't grab it yet. He stops a lot faster, it looks like. The controls are very, like, tight. Like, he's really, like, running around super, uh... Yeah. Oh, oh Bowser's <gasps> a pimp now. Oh, no. Bunnies? New enemies. New enemies? Hey, it's not the Koopalings, so I'm even more sold. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Holy cow, that's amazing. Unless Mario's turning into Sonic now. <laughs> <laughs> that thing was so cool. This looks like a whole... Whoa! Odyssey. Oh, my 
gosh. Yeah, I'm pretty He's blown. He's had sentient. Yep, I figured. Oh, no. <laughs> I hate it now. I'm pretty blown away right now. Holy crud. What? Hello, everyone. Sorry for my appearance. I am Yoshiaki Koizumi, the producer of Super Mario Odyssey. Am I dreaming? <laughs> what was that? This please be a launch game. I bet you 20 bucks it's not. Ugh. This is the first time since Super Mario 64 and Super Mario Sunshine <gasps> that we have created a large Mario sandbox world like this. Yep. For you. Kiss me. No. Okay. <laughs> I always get fur in my mouth when I do it. Oh my gosh, I can't believe this. <laughs> I need to find somebody to kiss. Wow! <laughs> perhaps you notice some landscapes that look familiar. I did. He hasn't been in Brooklyn in so long. I know, not since Mario's missing. Yeah. Early 90s. I, I did notice that. I am... I... Blabble go. Blabble go. What? <laughs> they even said it's... They didn't leave us hanging. They said it's open. Like 64 and 7. What? Yeah. <laughs> that's, no! that's, that's the kind of clarity they need. And that's mm. what I wanted and that's never... That's what so many people have wanted I forever. never, ever expected it. Everyone loved the linear stuff so much. I think they're... Because they, cause they know so many people are watching that haven't really stuck around with Nintendo, so they want the open world stuff. That's what they remember. Yeah. Playing on nostalgia. I can't believe it. Oh my gosh. Dang yeah, it. Yeah, I, I knew it. That's well, as early as I could have expected Well, I'm going to pre-order it. Holy and it better And it better have a collector's edition, and since it's not region locked, the Japanese version might have a better collector's edition, and I'll get that one. <laughs> I, uh, I can't even... Bye. I'm going to walk away now. I can't believe it. Oh, oh no way. Oh, monolith? Is it an X port? I bet it's an X port. Oh, Xenoblade. Oh, the original Xenoblade. Maybe? Or a new one. I have no idea. I'm not familiar enough with them to I'm know. Not either. What kind of video game guy are you? You didn't play those games? <laughs> it's, it's a single player MMO. Yeah. That's what Xenoblade is. I'm not a fan of them. All the people who are familiar with it are like, oh my gosh, this thing that is this exact thing that I know what it is. <laughs> it looks different. Yeah, they changed the art style. It might not actually be Xenoblade, but it's made by the same people. Yeah, I, I kind of expected an X port. Well, I would have expected a, a port of X if they didn't put it on the new 3DS. I mean, considering how gargantuan that tree is, it seems like a Xenoblade. Just because that was the whole theme. It was gigantic things. And magical, super colorful weapons. I'm gonna... This is gonna end up being the subject of a whole video, I'm sure. But you know what excites me about all this? Hmm. Their emphasis on the open world thing. How they're like, this is the Switch. And here's Zelda. Here's possibly Skyrim. Here's Xenoblade. Here's an open world Mario. Here's depth. Here's big games. Yeah. Like this... Oh my... This is what I've been wanting from them forever. Two? Two. Wow! I don't, I'm not a fan of those games, but I'm sure a lot of people right now are flipping out. Yeah. I can count that as a good thing, even if it doesn't exactly yeah. tailor to me. Exactly my thoughts. B open stuff. Mm -hmm. Depth. That's, I, I'm still uh, trying to. Oh, this is probably just Hyrule Warriors 2 or something. Ah. <laughs> or uh, it's something new. Other M2. <laughs> Team Ninja. Oh yeah, it was Team Ninja. What? Team Ninja and the people that make the Dynasty games. Alright. That's fi Fire Emblem? Is this, Fire, is this Emblem? Fire Emblem? I don't know. What has Fire Emblem? It's Fire Emblem, is that Fire Emblem as Dynasty Warriors. <laughs> Do we know? You're gleaning it, that? Oh my Are word. You, is that a that's symbol the, for Fire That's Emblem? the Fire Emblem. Oh, I don't know It's that. a shield <laughs> with all those gems in it. I don't even care if there isn't gameplay. This w is Force. Kind of w Force is the people that make... Er, W Force. Omega Force, they make the Dynasty Warriors games and Hyrule Warriors. Maybe you're right. I've been asking for this for uh, since Hyrule Warriors. I was like, you know what would be better than Zelda characters, honestly? Fire Emblem characters. That's all they're going to show. Dang it. <laughs> <laughs> uh. 
Fire Emblem Warriors. Uh, there you go. You got it. Uh, I've wanted that as soon I'm, as I heard of Hyrule Warriors. You got exactly a weird kind of obscure thing you wanted. <laughs> I feel really good for you. I'm excited. That's cool. Uh. Just a few, but, but. Oh, I hope that's not it for the first party showings. Uh. In Japan. Yeah. Because mm. we only have like four of them over here. <laughs> I've also never been a fan of those ones. I've never played one. Can't say take a look at this too soon. Post apocalyptic. Oh, so this isn't. I thought it was gonna be just Atlas. showing us Dragon Quest. Atlas makes good stuff. They also make a lot of not, but uh, I've never heard of them. Yeah. I'm Wait, twenty fifth is it twenty fifth anniversary of something? So that's. SNES, NES era? Oh, yeah. I feel like I should know. Uh. Well, here's a ton of yokai. <laughs> I still don't know. Yeah. I some people, like some I people should. are freaking out, I'm sure. Yeah, but. and they're like, you're stupid. It's obviously. Uh, oh, that guy! I recognize him. I don't know what he's from. Uh, but I recognize. Oh, what's... Dis Dissidia? No. Is it a Dragon Quest? <laughs> it might be Dragon Quest. By Atlas, though? I think they actually do uh, Dragon Quest. Do they? Because they're just, they're just a publisher. I mean, that would... The 25th anniversary would make sense. You thought it was Dragon Quest, but it was me, Dio! <laughs> uh, uh, I don't know... I do... Oh. I recognize that little demon dude in the very front, though. I don't know Japanese. Atlas, mm. Can we get... A thing with the English. He'll say it, maybe. I recognize the, that one guy. Oh, we're getting another one before they tell us what that is. A vast world of adventure. Oh. Whoa. Okay. Pixel and 3D at actually, the same I actually time. really like this. It looks pretty interesting. This is how remakes of classic games should be. Yeah. What is what is this though? This, this looks like Final Fantasy IV four? or three. I'm not familiar enough with the Octopath Traveler. Oh, well, there you go. Whatever that is, Maybe. it was the same art style as the early Final Fantasies, though. What you just saw was the latest game in the Atlas series, Shin Megami Tensei. That was it. The cartoony oh. Shin Megami Tensei's. Oh. I didn't know it back that far. The first one was on the NES. I had no idea. Oh, it's a new oh. thing. Okay. It looks it's cool. You're just using the same art style, but it looked way cool. Yeah. A unique graphic style and sense of scale. Please look forward to additional information in the future. Now, let's hear from some of the developers working on new games. <laughs> Hello, everyone, and just give it a moment for some Sega. Uh oh. Uh oh. Sonic. <laughs> We're they getting do, it right here. They do more than Sonic. I don't care. <laughs> Sonic 2017. <laughs> I know uh, Sonic Mania was already confirmed for it. We will consider new games for Nintendo Switch and will present them to you. So uh, we have nothing right now. I don't know why I'm here. <laughs> this new hardware is taking on Present them soon. Has a lot of repeating points. The problem with Sonic games is I can never tell how good they are by the trailer. You don't know until you pick it up. Yeah. Because Lost Worlds looked awesome. Thank you very much for your time today. Like, I thought that was going to be cool. Thank you, Sonic. Sonic Mania looks really good. 
but then the new Sonic 2017, I don't know. Mm. Oh, hey. Finally confirming Skyrim, yeah, Mario. Yeah, Please, I don't have a life. I have unlimited time, please. <laughs> I've already, like, I have over a thousand hours in this game. Wow, I don't so, like. So I'm probably not going to bother with the port. I mean, I wouldn't even, because I have it on PC. But you can do it on the go. Portable Skyrim. That's a life destroyer. <laughs> I haven't played it a ton, but I did have, like, my one. Like, I don't have enough, I don't know, dedication or time or whatever. So I just have, like, the one file that I, like, put everything into. Yeah. And I kind of did everything I wanted to do in that game. So I probably, I mean, I would enjoy it. But I don't have time if yeah. I'm just going to kind of enjoy it. Being an adult with responsibilities. I, stupid. <laughs> I hate it. I mean, I would love this, but I just, I can't. Oh, yeah, if, if I was still in school, if I was a teen, this would be the greatest. Yeah, this isn't a game you just like, oh, just dinkle around with it for a little bit. Like, no, it's, you want to play it forever. The pun's officially dead. Uh, Grasshopper manufacturer. As, as soon as he did that pose, I'm like, oh, this is a guy from Grasshopper, isn't he? Really? I've never heard. <laughs> They're, uh, all their games are crazy ridiculous. Huh. I love them. Is he getting translated? Today I'd like to start um, at, the, at the new virus that comes this and I'd like to talk about They're live uh, translating this. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Do you all remember the one guy from the Santa Destroyers was doing out of a tech team team Marvelous and Grasshopper? It's like Travis Touchdown. Yeah. Do you any chance to return on the Switch? Oh, nice. Have you ever played the No More Heroes games? Uh, no, I wanted to pl I heard the first one was good yeah, when it they're, came out. They're both really good. Like, probably the best M-rated Wii game. I'm really surprised they brought it back. That's cool. Once again, cool for fans of that. <laughs> I'm waiting for something else that hits me. This guy has no enthusiasm. <laughs> the guy getting translated is like, whoa, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. The translator's like, um, I'm, uh... Uh, help. We're working with the Nintendo Switch. I'm I'm just translating, but it's hard for me to translate emphasis at the same time as translating <laughs> on the f fly. I think he lost his audio feed and is now just kind of making it up. Mm. That's why he's, he's like, I heard it's a good uh, platform. <laughs> We're doing a game. Uh. <clears throat> that does bring up, because um, like it uses a Tegra chip, mm -hmm. so like that means it's really easy to port mobile games to it. Mm. And like mobile to PC is also easy. And if it's easy to go from mobile to PC, it's also easy to go from Xbox and PS4 to PC to Switch. Mm -hmm. So like there should be a ton more third-party games on it, if it has a good launch. Yeah, if it sells. If it sells, it'll have plenty third-party support. But then the problem is, oh, I don't want to downgrade my game to port it over because it's on the mm -hmm. PS4. Blah, blah, blah. By this is so boring. I don't know what he's talking about. Just show me a game if you're going to show me a game. <laughs> thank you very much. <laughs> he put a lot of emphasis there. Thank you, thank you very much. Really? Nothing? Uh-oh. If you don't come back on in four seconds. Uh-oh. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. <laughs> Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Uh, Is it me? I don't know. Uh, uh, no, Barton, that's good. It's them. Uh, or you're, uh, do you refresh, or do you then lose it forever if you refresh? Of course, it happened right after a boring thing. Nah, right. Uh, uh, yeah, oh yeah. Try okay, it is happening to everyone. <laughs> is everyone like, ah? Yeah. <laughs> oh no, oh no, oh no. <sighs> also, it's going so fast, no one can ever read any of this. Yeah. Oh, they're still just talking about the bad translator. Oh, then maybe it's not. I don't know. Refresh your page. Try it. Okay, I'll refresh. I saw someone talking about the new translator being good. The old translator has been sacked. Cool. Oh, it's that guy from, what's it? EA. EA. I'm really glad the refreshing worked. <laughs> Looks like we missed something great. Hey, it's great. Going again. Oh, you probably just missed the... Now let's switch over oh, to yeah. this guy. <laughs> this 
This guy from EA. Please don't be sports. Okay. Well, uh, I'm going to go to the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure for sports fans, that's great. Yeah, it is a very good selling game. We've never seen Bill go the other way. Go the two Japanese. <coughs> Unprecedented partnership. It's FIFA. Wow. <clears throat> not going to show you, though. I know, they got to stop just talking to us and not showing us. Like, well, it might be a business decision because they know it doesn't look as good as like the other versions. you got to at least show a teaser or a logo. Like, at least this has a logo. If a weird guy comes on, and it's just like, Wait, you're Hey, you're Travis dead. Touchdown's coming back. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> I promise. <laughs> I could be lying, but I'm totally not. Yeah, never thought I'd see him in a Nintendo event. Yeah. My, I guess that means EA is betting on it. Yeah, yeah, or at least for one single sports port <laughs> or yeah. something. And it's probably mean, but just seeing this guy's face, like. Just when it first came on, I was just like, I just got these feelings of sleepiness. Yeah. The corporate overlord. Yeah, because uh, <laughs> like every time he, I've ever, it's just like, unconditioned. It was, yeah, I think it was last E three. He was wearing like an all black suit and he looked like a supervillain in a family movie. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like the big mean commercial businessman that's gonna tear down the forest with the poor owls in it. Yeah. <laughs> It the poor owls. When you only come on and ever talk about sports, it's just the reaction I'm going to have. Yeah. So then when I just see you, it's I It's like go, this is a press event. Like, it's meant for the press, mainly. So they're going to go more in-depth with games tomorrow morning. I wonder, like, how many of them, or if they're going to... Probably won't, like... Probably, they Mario haven't showed a lot of them. Maybe Mario yeah. and ARMS, and that'll be it. Because it's, it's Nintendo much. Treehouse, so it's probably going to be just them. Is this it? Oh, good. His, His portion. portion. Okay. I mean, you gotta tell me, Reggie. I want specs. I saw Sonic in there I and did. Bomberman. I saw Sonic. Bomberman's supposed to be dead, I thought. Sonic 06 port. Oh, God. <laughs> Easy joke. Yeah. That's my biggest thing, though. That's that Mario. crazy. I really do. Mario's my man. Like... Yeah, Mario's pretty awesome. I am hoping for, like, one more, like, good surprise. Thing. Oh, hey, Minecraft. I really Who hope. would have thought that? <laughs> hey, get it on there quick. Don't beat Dragon's around the bush Quest. this time. Dragon's Quest exclusively for Japan. Oh, Lego City Undercover. Another one. Another just open world type one. Mm -hmm. Was that Farm Simulator? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Everybody's bingo cards are going off right now for the sizzle reel. Farm Simulator. Boing! <laughs> Whoa, that's that a new was, Sonic. Uh, Sonic 2017. I hadn't seen any. I didn't even know there was actual footage or anything. I didn't either, actually. Uh, was that a new Samurai Warriors or Nobunaga's Ambition? Because they used the same characters. Virtual Console. Is that Party Bomberman? Because Hudson Soft went out of business. I forget who bought Bomberman. Oh, I've seen that game. Is that a rhyme? Or is that a different one? I... I I know that probably wasn't F Zero, but I hope that was F Zero. <laughs> that was probably that uh, F Zero ripoff. I'm still wondering if this is going to have more. He said his portion, but this is—it looks like a wrap-up thing. Cut to Reggie with more game. Uh oh, is that it? Or is that just? I don't think we're going to get any big. Any more big surprises? I want specs. Today, you heard from some of these developers, but there are still many others working hard inside Nintendo to develop original game consoles. Mm -hmm. In addition to the franchises our fans have loved, we will also introduce the world to new forms of entertainment 
made possible by the unique characteristics of the Nintendo Switch hardware and the Joy-Con controller. Since we revealed new colors of Joy-Con during this presentation, allow me to share with you our Nintendo Switch product configuration. Cool configurations. It comes in blue. <laughs> <laughs> the Nintendo Switch system will include the Nintendo Switch console. Oh, that's good. And the right Joy-Con. Oh, I was hoping, we, or wondering if we should have to buy those separately. <laughs> the Joy-Con grip. And the base. The Nintendo Switch dock. An HDMI cable. Thank you. <laughs> and an AC adapter. Good. <laughs> yeah. Will also be available you, you can just use it for your old Switches. Oh, wait. There will be two versions. <laughs> one model. Oh, good. Joy-Con controller. Oh. Oh. Okay, that's Both not what I expected. The same suggested retail price. Really? You gotta get the hardcore enthusiast at lunch. You can make us pay fifty bucks extra for anything. Yeah. We will buy it. Come with the game. That first like five million units, you'll definitely sell at fifty dollars more. Mm-hmm. I'm still not getting any switch pre order available. <laughs> <coughs> Have you checked Amazon? Yeah. Checking everything. I'm signed up for all the email alerts and everything. Yeah. I wonder if I should have my laptop out right now so that <laughs> if they go up. I can barely hear him yeah, speaking English not. now. Get your bags. Going to London. I still can't believe March 3rd. Yeah, that's... Anytime you have to wait for anything, it's mm -hmm. always the end of the month just to make it harder to wait. Mm -hmm. I don't think anyone guessed that early in the month. Nobody. Why didn't they make it Mario Day? Why didn't they make it the 10th? Yeah. What's wrong well, with like, It's just because they're not... Because Mario isn't a launch title. <sighs> Wait, so so far only 1-2 Switch is a launch title. Yeah, we don't know anything about anything else. Uh. <laughs> Reggie! So that means he's not going to reveal anything. I hope that they don't just think the, the, the gimmick with the ice cubes and the 1-2 Switch is enough to sell this system. Mm -hmm. And the idea of Mario later. I mean, it's got me. Yeah. The Mario. Well, Mario and Zelda. Those are the two big ones. But you may get your own chance to play well before launch. Because the Nintendo Switch will be on display on six separate Sundays in six different cities across North America. It'd be really cool to go to the one in San Fran. But it's all like first come, first serve or whatever. Yeah, and it's three hours away. Yeah, I wouldn't drive all the way there just to maybe not get in. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna get my laptop out. I can't. <laughs> ah, it's in the other room. Never mind. I have email alerts and text alerts turned on from like four different websites. <laughs> so. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. What games? <laughs> Launch titles. Maybe you can hear Glory. In the air. It's probably talking about Zelda. Yep. There it is. The soundtrack for what's been far and away the most anticipated Nintendo Switch game right from the start. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Launch title. So, where is it? Well, it'll be here at a special event elsewhere in New York tomorrow. I see some sneaky Nintendo employees have been playing during this presentation. That's the uh, designer of it. <laughs> ah, hi 
Sorry, Beach Con. You're here early. You're playing the new Legend of Zelda game. How do you like it? What do I know? Good. Oh, that's great. Nice. Good. Well, so many eager fans want to know the one critical question. When are we launching the Legend of Zelda? Well, it's, you know, they won't wait until I'm up here. How did I do? Dr. <laughs> Iannuma, you're the producer for the Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. You know everything about Next you. holiday. Certainly you must know holiday 2018, yeah. <laughs> You're making me mad here! <laughs> if they know that this is what everyone's wanting. If it's not a launch title, I will laugh so hard after all of this. Look at that. Oh, yep. Spoils. I'll have to come back to this lesson in a second. Wake up! The Nintendo Switch launch is just around the corner on March 3rd. And Zelda will launch March 4th. Yeah. <laughs> we'll hold a Nintendo Switch hands-on event at the big site in Tokyo. And we'll begin taking pre-order reservations for retail in Japan starting January 23rd. They can just that decision for all the retailers? I guess so. That's weird. I hope that we've shown enough to earn your support. Uh, I guess. Oh, I gotta pre-order anyway. It's part of my job, but... One last thing to share with you today. The Zelda launch date. Now a game. I would like to humbly and sincerely thank everyone here for listening and everyone around the world for tuning in. I need one more. Just like one more first party something we know. And not just a Breath of the Wild trailer. It's a Breath of the Wild trailer. Uh, Maybe. Yeah, that's Death Mountain. Man. I mean, yay, <laughs> but... Hey, Tropical... Tropics Zelda. Has there been Tropics in Zelda before? Not to memory. No. I can't watch this. I've been avoiding all of it. <laughs> if anything starts happening, I'm gonna... I don't know what to watch now. There's foxes in it. Spoilers. <laughs> My eyes are shut. I'm not looking. Uh, there's a forest. What's that? Oh, come on. <laughs> there's a... More of those guys from Wind Waker. Oh, no. I'm finding out everything here. And oh, I'm not looking at it. The dragonfly? Oh, no, that's the Master Sword. <laughs> oh, he gets the Master Sword. I thought he was going to get a sock and bopper. <laughs> More fun than a pillow fight? Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm looking down, down at the ground. Oh, I'm glancing up every once in a while because I can't help it. Uh, there's pretty music playing. It's really Okay, I'm looking. There's nothing happening. Yeah, it's just like, here's the landscape. Until he turns around with his VR goggles on. <laughs> I'm half looking. I'm kind of looking down. Snow. Horse. Yeah, this voices. is Voices. Oh, wow. The voices. Nope, I don't know that. I didn't hear you. I really wanted one more game. Yeah. But at least the one game did blow me away. Yeah. At the very least, there's that. There's enough to have me really hoping. Whoa, that's that's some stuff. Just one more. Pretty sure that's Calamity, Calamity Ganon. I'm like, oh no. Oh man, this sounds exciting. I'm down here on the floor. Wow, <laughs> is that a roll of tape? Nice. Oh, Scotch I've been brand. Looking, I've been looking for that forever. Scotch brand mailing tape. Wow, that's that's good. It's good tape. Strong. Also, my bet's still on. Uh, this takes place in the uh, Link loses timeline. Think so? That's still my bet. <clears throat> I have a batter; it just doesn't care. I feel like it's the Wind Waker one. The uh, the. Oh, that was the Deku Tree. The great Deku Tree from Ocarina. What was? What you just saw? The thing on the screen. That Don't, say <laughs> Don't say it! Don't say anything! <laughs> well, Zelda looks old. Uh, or but older. Yeah. Stop saying things. Like, not super young, like the other ones. Just tell me when the launch date comes up. Yep, they're all voiced. That's Goron, wow. Zelda, Fairy, all of them are voiced. Stop talking about things that are in the game. Especially fairies. I didn't think there'd be any fairies. The fairies all right, this is, uh, this is totally Wind Waker, actually. It's, it looks like Wind Waker. That's, uh... Because there's also those bird people. 
Those bird people only evolved because of the flood. Give me a date. Okay, I'm looking. Nah, nah. <laughs> Not looking. Hey, guess what? The scream died. The scream died? The stream died? The stream been... died. Oh, no, okay. It was on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> Scare me. Yep. Launch title. Woo! High five. Yeah! Ah, oh, I'm sure that's it. I think that's probably it. Yeah, they're that's probably not even going to say anything. It's just going to be this. Oh, come on. You got to let it. You got to take your bows. Yeah, that's it. The presentation has concluded. Thank you for watching. Launch title! Launch title! Thank you, thank you, thank you! 30 oh. exclamation point. How many How many exclamation points can I put in this tweet? I don't know, but put more than that. <laughs> wow. Okay. There we go. Tweeted. Interesting. It wasn't a total disaster. Yeah. That's great. A lot of questions still. I mean, they didn't even... You didn't actually cover the specs. No, I kind of didn't think they would. I feel like I they guess. released that later, like, to people. Yeah, two people, because yeah. I guess that's not a thing that a lot of people care about. That squeaky chair. Super, super squeaky chair. Uh, yeah, I expected more. Just about. I mean, we still don't know a lot of games that are coming to it. We have, like, a really, really small handful of, like, TBD games. And then Mario at Christmas. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, but not a lot. I mean, maybe they're saving some for E3. Yeah. I didn't think they would. I thought this would be it, but they have to be, because there's, I mean, there's barely any games, unless they just expect Zelda to really just carry it. Mm -hmm. It might. <laughs> it really easily might, because, oh my gosh. Wow. And that's what everyone's tweeting about now. The Mario, though. Like, that... Yeah, Mario's back in Brooklyn. The fact that the one, Mar the one big... First party game that was there was just that, cr like, yeah, oh my gosh. I am so happy that at least that was just like, yes, this is exactly what you wanted and more in weird ways. <laughs> that's the, that's, oh, that's oh, the I want more. I want more detail on the, um, the, those games that they just showed a few seconds of during the end thing. Oh yeah, there's a ton of, of like there was Sonic. There was a ton of stuff in there I wanted to see more of. At, at least, at the very least, Sonic and that possibly F-Zero, though not likely F-Zero game. Yeah. There might be more tomorrow. I mean, they could surprise us. They could show yeah. actually, like, oh, here's the thing you only saw a second of. Here's a whole thing on it. Maybe not, Man. though. I don't know. I'll be watching tomorrow, that's for sure. Oh, such a great release to finally have that over. And oh, how are man. you feeling? I'm feeling amazing. I'm feeling great. I'm surprised they didn't show at least something Pokemon-related. Yeah, something, anything else related. Even if it was just, hey, we're working on Pokemon, like they did with the, with Travis Touchdown, No More Heroes. Like, hey, yeah. I'm working on No More Heroes 3. Bye. Like, it just had Pokemon people come up and, like, Pikachu appears on screen and is like, Pika! Yeah. With the Switch logo, and that that's it. They, they could have done that. <laughs> they left us with way more questions. But they did show us some cool stuff. Mm -hmm. Mario, that's all I... That... So, two launch titles. Zelda at launch... And Mario one, two, cool. Switch. I can't believe it. it's open world. I can't, well, I'll just sit here and gush forever about it, though. We should probably stop. I need to go home and put this that we just did on the internet. <laughs> I'll have a whole video. I don't know exactly what the angle will be, but it'll be something. Yeah. I mean, you don't even need to edit it, really. You want me to stop it? Is oh, it time to stop it? Sure. Time uh, to say our goodbyes. Oh. I that gotta, was amazing. I gotta think on some stuff. I really gotta think. Mario. Oh my gosh. I would have bet a thousand dollars the next Mario would not be like that. And they just completely did. That's the Nintendo thing! They do what you don't expect every time! You can never, ever expect anything of Ever! <sighs> they got me again. They got me again! I'm so glad they did. Okay, I'll see you later, everybody. I have to go to sleep or something. Eat some fruit. I don't know. Bye, all. Thank you for Loxton having the Loxton words. You're Thank welcome. Thank you for joining me here on this. Thank you for letting me into your office. It it's, was amazing. It's really beautiful. Goodbye, all. Goodbye.